What's going on, everybody? Z here. Welcome back to so my Osiris and New Dawn. We are back. We're doing the things, doing the stuff. Uh, it is a, a beautiful rainy day here on Proteus something or other. Uh, anyways, oh, it's a hydrocarbon rainstorm. Interesting. So we are back. Last episode, we got our buggy, which is, oh my gosh, absolutely amazing. That's going to help us do all the things, all the stuff. Uh, we got a workbench. We've got a, a standard furnace and we have our respawn point. Let's go ahead and activate that but we've got to get some things done because this is the beginning and we have nothing so we are going to go ahead actually you're hungry find food yeah we actually need to really find food we need to get a, a, a decent supply of uh food and water so let's pop in here let's grab a let's see what do we have left okay so we've got one food left oh rough um we got that going but we need to get some food we need to get some water we need to get some basic base things figured out and just have a good time hopefully you guys enjoy if you do like subscribe all the fun things um also i am trying out a new description uh so if you look down below there's a new description in there and there's actually um there's actually some dynamic parts of that which I, like i said i'm playing with where like most recent subscriber most recent discord member things like that it actually updates in real time so if you become a subscriber and you refresh real quick you might actually be able to see your name in the description um so yeah super cool and thank you all so much for uh, all the support on the first video now let's get into it so uh what is our what's our objective right now do we have an objective i don't think we actually have an objective here but i want to do some base building stuff so like let's look at build utilities um we need to build the forge a forge can use to smell um more advanced alloys can be upgraded to forge basic firearms enables the construction of more advanced shelter options okay so defenses structures we don't really have anything like that um we do have some defenses we have some rock walls and stuff like that i'm not super worried about that I think the forge is going to be our um our number one priority now i think we do need to make a scrap metal chest so we can store some stuff so we actually need to get some patch tape for that um hold on i gotta get used to this whole uh menu here so let's grab this let's grab a patch tape and then let's grab a uh, utilities let's grab a scrap metal chest here and let's just put that maybe right here next to the forge uh yeah that looks good so we'll drop some stuff off and then we're gonna go take the buggy out we're gonna do some exploration i'm hoping that eventually we uh stop having the rain because like that's not what i want in my life okay so let's keep those let's keep some fibers on us for some makeshift patch tape i don't think we need any of these bits okay cool so our inventory is nice clean and clear okay rain you're making this a horrible day like it's a horrible rainy day um but let's head back down here Ooh, i don't even know where my buggy went <laughs> let's head back over here and let's finish scrapping all of the stuff from our uh our shuttle and then we're gonna do some more explorational type things we've got to find some basic metals and basic things like that wait is this seriously not scrapped anymore wait a second is this really not scrapped anymore oh so do these respawn every time we log out no way no way that would be broken glass i mean that like this could be amazing some scrap metal okay i'm gonna go through and scrap all of this stuff we'll see what we get out of it <gasps> oh a container with water oh how wonderful so i'm actually curious do these things like seriously respond every time we log in and log out i like i know it's early access so i'm not i'm not gonna knock the game at all for that but uh that's kind of funny and that might make our our mission a lot oh it's beautiful sunny out now <gasps> yay okay so i think i got everything that we could scrap um i mean we have a decent amount of stuff like we got a bunch i mean we got a plastic scrap we got some scrap hinge um some lead did we get lead from this we must have because i'm pretty sure all the things the only things we had was like this stuff right here some glass um a water thing which is gonna be super nice broken wire um we got some more emergency rations which is always a good thing never complain about that let's see if there's any more stuff that i missed i don't see anything okay so in order to get that forge built um let's see let's go ahead and hop in here let's go see what we need to get that forge built i think we're gonna have to i think we're gonna have to get some basic items and then we might actually have to make a better chisel first i'm not sure okay so in order to get 
build craft uh, utilities. So we need brass, bronze, mercury. I mean, we have lead, sulfur, circuit board, all of that fun stuff. I don't actually, we can't actually make a lot of that stuff yet. Unless workbench. Oh, we can make some electronics. So broken circuit board, wire. Okay, we're gonna have to go out salvaging. I think salvaging is going to be probably what we're gonna have to do. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's drop off everything we can in here. Okay, so apparently that's all we can. All right, let's go see what we can find here. You know what, let's actually pop up to this, um, this spaceship again real quick because there was a crate in there and it probably respawned. So we're never ever gonna take the crates down because if they respawn and give us more free stuff, like I am all about that. Uh, yeah. Was this a broken computer screen first aid kit? Heck yeah, let's roll with that. All right, let's go see what else we can find here. Now I have, if if this map is similar to the, the, the map I was playing last time, like the original map, and they just added some more terrain stuff to it. I have a rough idea of where we're going to be able to find stuff, but I don't know. We shall see. Oh, wasn't this a material that we couldn't actually touch yet? Tin. Oh, interesting. Okay. Well, let's grab some tin. I'm sure we're going to need it for something. I'm trying to keep an eye out for, uh, for some aliens. Okay, uh, we got a little bit of tin here. How much tin do we get? We got 16. I'm not gonna grab a, I'm not gonna grab a ton of it. Because like I said, I don't I don't want to get completely loaded up on like one resource. I want to be able to see like what's what. So we know that's tin. We have an area of tin. I don't know if there's those things respawn or not. You know, this area used to be where the giant mega huge worm thing came out. Oh, there's some crystals over here. Some crystalline structures. What are these? Tungsten. Okay, so we can't get that because it's a hardness of 7.5. And I think the hardness on our tool is only 4 right now. There's another bunker. So that is a dungeon type thing. What do we have down here? Um, It looks like more tin and a purple gas... All right, let's make our way over here. The reason, <laughs> the reason I want to go over here, is because I know there, uh, the Osiris One base used to be over there. Rock outcropping. They just gave us rock. Okay, what is this? I just not look like a rock though. This looks like it's more than rock. You know what I'm saying? Like these look like these look different than this. Oh, that one's not even har harvestable. Okay, never mind then. Okay, let's push on over here. So that way there used to be some oxygen. Oh, and that's where the worm used to come out as well. It's like there's some like scrap or stuff on the ground. Is the giant evil space worm gonna come out right here though? I don't see anything. Okay, let's grab this space debris. Actually, you know what? Oh, space debris does give us scrap plastic though. And like other scrap materials. I'm curious what those rocks are right there. I don't know what those are. All right, you know what? Let's actually, let's head out of here. Let's get out of this area. I want to see what these rocks are right here. Oh, never mind. I'm not ready to fight one of those yet. Mm -mm, no, sir. No, thank you. Oh, this rock over here. Okay, so we've got some of those guys. What is this? Zinc? Let's grab a little bit of zinc. Never know when we're going to need that. Also, mercury. We have to figure out where we're going to get mercury from. Okay, so we've got... Oh, time to go! Time to go! Alien inbound! See you later, you stupid alien! Oh my gosh. I thought we were goners. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad I left what I did because I did not hear that guy coming up on me. Okay. So this way, okay, we're going to pop in here real quick. 
this way there used to be a gi gigantic okay yep um big huge crevasse here and then oh there's the rubber trees well they used to be rubber trees and then over here you, there used to be an osiris one base what is that what is this silver i feel like we're gonna need that for something Okay, that's everything. All right. Oh, uh, man. I wish there was lights on this thing. Okay. And then we've got... Oh, there's some more outcrop things right here. As well. Oh, here's the Osiris 1 base. Oh, there's a big rover over here. Okay. Um, Man, I can't see anything right now. Do we have an, a light? Oh, Hey, yo. So, yeah, we have this giant guy. And then, oh my gosh. There's a bunch of tanks. A bunch of solar panels. And then we've got, so this area. Now, this area used to be haunted. There was a special enemy type that actually used to came out, come out in this area. Um, Should we try to... I'd like to see what this is about. It looks like it's all broken. Okay, I'm hearing some sounds here. And I'm a little scared. Okay, so it doesn't look like there's anything we can do here. Oh, I hate that it's already dark. Um, you know what? Let's go in here. Okay. I don't see anything like super scary. There used to be an enemy type in here that honestly was one of my favorite enemy types. It was really cool as a ghost of like the um, the dead survivors. Or, well, I guess if they're dead, they're not survivors, are they? The uh, the dead crew from before. So we used to have to interact with the bodies, but it doesn't look like we interact with the bodies anymore. Let's pop out of here real quick. Let's go this way. All right, I'll take everything out of there. Can we like do any deconstructing here? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, I wasn't sure if maybe this was like supposed to be like our first base place kind of thing. Uh, it does not look like it. Are these full of anything? Fuel here, handle with care. We got solar panels. Huh. Uh, what do we have here? Rock. Okay, so this is a little bit different than before. What is this guy? Is this more rock outcropping? Is this rock too? Man, there's so many different types of rock outcrops. Some fuel. These solar panels look like... Like, it's weird. It gives us, like, a different, like, a hit box with it. So, like, I'm kind of curious. Like, can we... Can't deconstruct those. Okay. Okay, let's head over... Those are sheddings. I'm trying to figure out where to find mercury here. You know what let's head back um actually you know what we're so close that's a, a shedding oh this area looks super cool but also like super deadly like i really want it to be daytime so we can actually see what the heck's going on here <gasps> what is that right in front of us that's like a blue rock uh let's go take a peek are these just more rocks oh my gosh they're all just rocks Hmm. All right, you know what? Let's head back. Let's head back to our base. Let's see what we can build. I don't imagine it's going to be like anything, but let's just check. We're not far from our base anyways. Oh, we're back at home. Uh, let's go ahead and sleep. Okay, so we got some items here. Now... 
We need circuit boards. We haven't found any broken circuit boards yet. And was there a way for us? So mercury. I mean, I figured mercury would be a liquid, but on this planet, it might be a solid. Wow, oh, there's like all different types of materials here. Oh, brass is copper and zinc. Okay. So what do we need for a better diamalloy? Di di it sounds like it's two alloys. Huh. Can't even craft that. So we must be able to craft the regular furnace first. So brass, bronze, glass, sulfur. Okay, so hold on. Let's see. Brass, we need copper. Bronze, we need copper and magnesium. Glass, we need sand or broken glass. And then we also need a circuit board wire, sulfur, and mercury. And a fuel cell. What does the fuel cell take? Because we did make a fuel cell with our uh, our buggy already. Wait, is there... Wait, how did we make a fuel cell? Is that something we can craft in our inventory? Craft... Defense structures, appliances. Huh. I actually don't know how to make the battery. Okay, well, we can't do a whole lot just sitting here. So let's hop back in here and let's go a different way. Let's go over here. I really want to get the other chisel so we can start getting some of this like iron and stuff. But we need a. a we need a different material type. We also need magnesium. Molly bendium. So like that sounds like what I would use to smelt that m molly alloy stuff, but I'm mm, don't know. All right. And then let's see this way used to be there used to be an outpost over here. Let's see if this outpost is still over here because they're oh that stuff looked like magnesium that stuff absolutely looks like magnesium. can we just drive up there oh my gosh this buggy is a boss get up there bud you can do it oh my gosh you did it that looks like magnesium it is okay so that's one thing that we needed all right we got a little bit of magnesium here that's super cool. Glad that we found that. Let's keep going this way, though. Uh, let's see. We got some kind of valley over here. Valley of bioluminescent trees. Sounds like death. Oh, there is an outpost over here. Oh, it's different, though. Before, it almost looked like a fuel refining kind of camp. Are there any aliens around here? There might not be. Can't do anything with that guy. That looks like hydrogen. Oh, I touched the thing. All right, we're good. We're patched up. Let's go ahead and pop into here. Oh, the light is always so creepy on this game. Hello. Sorry you didn't make it. Feel terrible for you. Nothing amazing. I haven't found any broken circuit boards yet. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Asking you shall receive. <laughs> awesome. Okay, so there's our broken circuit board. So that's going to obviously go to the forge first. Okay, let's squeeze out of here. We already went in there. What else is around over here? Yeah, I'm thinking this is hydrogen, right? Yeah, okay, cool. So, I don't know. I don't think any of these, like, standard things. Ooh, don't touch the cactus plant. Actually, you know what? I need you. All right, let's see what this is overlooking. Valley of death. Oh. Of course it's a valley of death. Ooh. That lag makes me feel like something loaded in that I don't want to be a part of. 
Okay, so holy geez, something over there does not like being loaded in. I think it's over that way. So. Oh, hello. Uh stupid alien of death. Um, so we need we need some weird resources that I haven't found yet. Maybe we need to harvest more rocks. Rock outcropping. These are all rock outcroppings. I'm curious as to why they all look different though. That one gave us a little bit of gold. That one didn't give us anything. Okay, so I restarted the game because uh, that lag that I was having when I was looking over an area, it kind of progressed through the game. So I restarted. Now, also, I want to I want to clarify, I did actually change something in here. Um, I disabled the pickup animation. So like the, the animation of like you actually grabbing something. I turned that off just so we could just pick it up in like, you know, instantaneously. And then mineral respawn rate was at finite. But I put it at normal uh, because I would like to continue playing the game and like finite resources kind of limit how much you can do uh, but everything else is the same oh no 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 storm spawn chance i did uncommon and then storm length is short i was hoping that there'd be like a night like a nighttime multiplayer so we could like speed through nighttime you know for the sake of uh recording stuff but um yeah i didn't that that's what i updated so just so you know we're gonna hop back in but yeah i was having some weird stuttering issue with uh when i went over to that area it was like it was loading something and then i don't know what was going on yeah, much better. Okay, so let's see here. We got, what did we need to build here? Um, So we needed brass, bronze, glass, and a circuit board. So let's see if we can't get, what do we need for a circuit board? A wire? Okay, so let's get a wire. And then we'll go ahead and get a circuit board. Because we need that. I'll go ahead and take that guy. And then from there, we need one glass, bronze, two wire, sulfur, brass. Okay, and then brass. I think we had, didn't we have bronze? Oh, we need the copper. We still need copper for that. Okay. And then we need two wire, which I only have the stuff to make one. Actually, I might, I might have, did we put wire in here? Yes, we did. Okay, cool. I have to backpack. Let's go ahead and make another wire. So we'll take those and then let's go ahead and throw some of that stuff in here. So let's throw the, um, let's throw that in there. And then we have one, one piece of broken glass. I can't even believe that. It's just like one singular piece of broken glass. That's kind of funny. Uh, I'm going to throw everything else in here that I can. Okay. So we need to find copper oh my gosh it's already dark again i feel like it's darker in this game more than it's light <laughs> like, i don't know what the deal is so i slept to try to get through uh through the night time it didn't work so we're gonna have a hop back on here and we are gonna make our way over so we've already gone that way kind of we haven't gone up in there yet looking for more resources we need this daimali stuff and I don't know where to find it. So we're going to head this way a little bit because we headed this way before and we got destroyed by some uh, some crabs and well, uh, an alpha crab, actually. But we're going to head over here because the sp starting sp spot is like, you know, literally right. Oh, all the stuff is gone now. Oh, no, it's not all gone. That's still there. Interesting. OK, we're going to head this way to see if we can't find some something. Ooh, ooh, that looks like sulfur. 100% looks like sulfur. Oh, hello. We got some little cave, we got some little nasties here. Don't really want to play with you in the darkness. Did they chase us? Oh, I can't see anything. Okay, this is definitely like the edge of this area. It doesn't look like we can go any further out. Okay. It's about to be nighttime. I don't see any of those nasties following us. So we're going to wait till daytime to see if we can't go get some of that delicious sulfur. 
You know what? I think those little guys we could probably fight. Should we see if we can just fight them? Let's do it. Let's see if we can fight them. Because that looks like sulfur. It is sulfur. I'm trying to make sure I'm not going to get sneak attacked here. But I don't see anything. Oh, big guy. Big guy, big guy, big guy, big guy. Get in. Let's roll. We are out. Goodbye. I'm not staying to fight. No, thank you. Don't want to play with you. You're a jerk. <laughs> oh, look at more crops. <gasps> what are these? Is that like uranium, plutonium or something? It's got to be. All right, let's pop out real quick. What is it? Uranium. Right, let's grab some of this. Okay, we're back in our vehicle. We're kind of safe. Not really, because the man, that guy is persistent. Okay. I think it's following the sounds. Okay, it's time to go. All right, we got a little bit of uranium. Uh, we can always come back. We can always come back. I'm guessing these are just rock outcrops now. Oh, there's the um, there's that first buggy that we found. <laughs> we got destroyed trying to trying to look at. Is the plutonium is there? Good to know. What do we have over here. Is that a rock outcrop? Rock outcropping. Of course it is. Okay, and that just basically circles back around. Okay, so since it's daytime, we're going to go back over this way and we're going to go towards those uh, big fluorescent trees. See if we can't get anything good from those. We need copper. We're really looking for copper right now. And mercury, whatever, whatever that looks like. Okay, you know what? There's stuff down here. We've got to pop down here and check this out real fast. What are you? Titanium? Okay, I can't get that. Uh, what else do we have down in here? I actually built a base down in here a long time ago. These all look like titanium. Okay, and then here's the Osiris 1 base. Now, we were going this way. It looks like there's actually a whole bunch of stuff over that way, too. Let's go this way and see what we can find over here next to these big bioluminescent trees. Hello, bioluminescent trees. You are so pretty. But this is probably such a deadly area. I mean, we got the green gr or the blue grass everywhere. I bet you this is like Death City. Oh, got some broken down stuff here. Actually, kind of like this area. Let's pop out. Let's um, let's grab this guy. You can come fight me, bro. Come fight me, bro. Oh, we can salvage this stuff. Needs repairs. Oh, we can repair it? Begin repairs. See, why would I begin repairs on this? Because, like, this looks like a terrible area. Maybe it's not? I mean... What is that? Why does that look like it wants to kill me? I think everything here wants to kill me. Begin repairs. Dismantle, begin repairs. Interesting. Are you going to come after me? Let's go, bro. Come on. Get some. Get some. Get some. Come on. Oh, you got friends. Not fair. All I got is like a sharpened rock. Suit breach. Not good. Oh, come on. Just die already. How are you not dead yet? How are you not dead? This one's like invincible. 
Did we get him? Are you kidding me right now? This thing is like invincible. You know what? I'm going to pop in here. We're going to go in here. Inventory, inventory. We're going to grab a patch tape. Use that. Do that. Oh my gosh. That was awful. Uh, let's use a bandage. Okay. So we're not so close to death now. Let's go ahead and do we butcher this? Now let's use a let's skin. Uh, let's butcher it. Where's the other one? We're going to butcher that one. We probably need some alien meat. Oh man, that guy was like rocking my world. Okay, fully healed up. Oxygen's low, it's re replenishing. Okay, so. Wrecked airlock. I mean, I guess we'll salvage it and see what we get. Okay. So, I mean, we got some stuff. Begin repairs. Oh, there's like certain parts of it that we can salvage. That's right. I'm, of course. So we got some magnesium. I need copper. So it takes Zamac and aluminum to repair this. What? Oh my gosh, we got copper. It was looking at us the whole time. It was watching us fight these bugs. Hopefully we're not attracting any bugs by doing this. Oh, these coppers are, these hills are made of copper. It's so nice. I need all of you copper. Actually, probably don't really need that much, but now we just need to find what mercury. Okay, so now we know where that's at. So we got to figure out where mercury is at now. All right, let's see if we can find some of this mercury. Actually, what gas do we have here? So we know oxygen. Okay. So this is a big, yeah, I remember this area. This is where we used to get rubber from the rubber trees. It was, uh, we came here quite a bit because we had to harvest lots of rubber for all the, all the vehicles and stuff like that. Mm. It was always so much fun. Oxygen geysers guessing these are just rock outcrops. Oh, that's that's right. Those are nothing Wonder where we can find mercury. I mean, is there anything we get from here? Undiscovered tree Let's See what we get here. This used to be a rubber tree. And we got tree bark or, oh, this thing is terrible. Forget that. We're not even going to try using that. So we got tree bark. Okay. For now, until we get better tools. And then this was copper. Looks like we got something kind of over here. Uh, we've got some iron Basically just a bunch of iron over here low fuel not good. Let's go ahead and pop in here open inventory. I'll take that and Oh, I put her into our hands. I forgot Perfect, okay where are we going to find mercury? Where are all these big solar panels from? This isn't from the Osiris one base, is it? No, these are big. What is this area? Huh? Oh, there's a base up there. Uh, what is this? Nickel. Oh, okay. So nickel is over here trying to figure out where like where everything's at so that way when we uh start needing some of the stuff we'll know you know we'll know you know 
Yeah, let's pop up here and let's look at this base. Maybe we'll get lucky and find Mercury. I don't know what Mercury is even going to look like. So, I mean, we've got some habitats here. We got a habitat. Uh, can we... I want these crates. So we got some scrap metal. We're gonna try to just take all of all of these. <gasps> a small and lightweight weapon as far as a blast requires ammo and maintenance. Oh, that sounds amazing, except for the ammo and maintenance part. <laughs> oh. Carrots, apples. So this must have been a, a greenhouse. Yeah, this was a greenhouse before. Very cool. Wrecked dome superstructure. Oh, gosh. Oh. We got a bunch of glass, derillium, mol uh, the molly stuff. The molly, molybium. Can you not build these anymore? Like, it's kind of weird that, like, there's all these structures that we can repair. It almost makes me think that we can't, like, build them ourselves, that we have to use the structures already here. But I, I don't think that's the case, because all these structures used to be buildable. Maybe they're just, like, super hard to get now. So, 8 of 12 wreckage is cleared. Oh, it's probably, probably those two, huh? Okay. Oh, very good stuff. All right, so if we pass hydrogen, we need to we need to get some hydrogen. Um, I don't know where Mercury's at. Let's move over here, maybe. Let's go to this this area. These tall trees. I see trees of blue, <laughs> red rocks everywhere. Uh, let's see. What are you? No, no, no. There's another satellite up here. Is that, oh, there's uh okay, so that's like the Osiris one base. I wonder what's over there. Let's pop over there. You know, I cannot imagine doing all of this on foot. That would be so terrible. Oh, hello, my friend. Oh, there's hydrogen right there. Could use that to top off. Uh, pretty sure we already looked at this stuff. Where do you look at this stuff? Chromium. Interesting. Okay, so we're going to actually have to get out and like look at all these resources because even some of the same like looking ones are actually different. Is this chromium as well? Yeah. Huh. Oh, what is that? Gold. Okay. Uh, we need to eat food. Oh, wow. We are so low on food. You know, actually, I have a little bit of gold already. Let's grab this one rock. This area is really cool looking, though. I do have to say it looks neat. The only problem is that we need a mercury, not gold. Oh, what the heck? What is all of this? It's so bright. What is this? Is this mercury? Oh, <gasps> yes. So is this like a pit of mercury? Oh, no way. Oh, that is super cool. That looks like amazing. Okay, let's see. Our hut is this way. Not super far. We got a little bit of mercury. Okay, I think... Did we get everything that we needed? I'm hoping we did. Okay, now I'm going to try to go back the same way that I... I'm trying to figure out, like, a good way back here. So I know, like, where... Ooh. Hello, my dude. Don't mind me. <laughs> we are just leaving. Oh, wait. Is this... Oh, this is the back side of that crater where we fixed the buggy at. Oh, so like the, the mercury is almost straight east of us. Okay. Good to know, good to know. 
All right, so now that we got all this stuff, can we go ahead? Let's make a brass, a bronze. Oh, that's right, we need fuel. Uh, Where's that bark at? Where's that tree bark at? Over here. No, that's alien hide. Tree bark, right there. Okay, so we've got brass, bronze. I don't know why I keep looking in there. I know we don't need to look in there. So we've got the brass, we've got sulfur, lead, mercury, do we not have the bronze? Oh, my inventory is like full. Uh, okay, let's swap some things here. Oh, I can't swap anything because I don't have another inventory. Can I build another storage chest? <laughs> I need a makeshift pack. Oh, you know what? We got this guy right here. Uh, inventory. Oh, we got another broken circuit board. I don't know where we got that from. Okay, let's just throw... Um, actually, you know what? I might need some fibers. Some stuff that I don't need. Oh, we needed the glass. I don't need plastic or the hinge or this. I don't think we need plutonium right now. Scrap rubber. Okay. Okay, so we'll take that out. Now, I don't know why I keep going back to the workbench. So we need two wire, a circuit board, a glass, and then the fuel cell. We might have to snag the fuel cell out of one of those buggies. So there's our two wire. There's our circuit board. Can we go ahead and make a glass? Okay, so let's take that. So we've got everything except for the fuel cell. So let's do this. Let's drop. Actually, we probably don't need to drop anything. I need to have, I need one fuel canister though. Uh, we're going to fill up with hydrogen and then we are going to go, we're going to go deconstruct the, the fuel cell out of the buggy. And we're going to see how that goes. Time is at eight. Let's go ahead and sleep. Oh, another beautiful morning. Crack of dawn. So many chances for possibilities and endless ex discoveries. Okay. So like I said, we are going to head over. We're going to go fill up with hydrogen and then we're going to go find that buggy. And we're going to try to take the, we're going to take the fuel cell out of it because I don't see how to actually craft a fuel cell. I don't see a fuel cell in here anywhere. And I know we crafted one for the buggy that we have, so I'm guessing we took it out of it. I don't know. I'm not positive. Perfect. So first stop is for some a wonderful fuel. And we're just going to go ahead and fill this bad boy up. And then we're going to go ahead and just throw this canister in here so we're good to go. All right, let's go see if we can't get a fuel cell out of that buggy. Okay, so last time we had super evil mega crab monster come and attack us while doing this. So we've got to be quick. Okay. Uh, fuel cell. Salvage. Okay, we got a fuel cell. We are out. That, my friends, should give us the forge, which I believe is going to unlock all kinds of possibilities for us. Okay, we're here. So I would say that getting that buggy first is like almost imperative because we basically had to go around the entire map in order to get the items for this forge. Let's go ahead and set that right there. Oh my goodness. Okay. Earn three science points. What did we unlock? We unlock a habitat structures. There it is there. Oh my gosh. What is a Zamac? Aluminum alloy. Uh, Derillium, derillion, copper, steel, rubber, but solar panels, chem station, printer, large radar, defensive walls, deep terrain drill, floodlight, deep terrain drill, what? Utilities, a large mining drill capable of extracting ore from a deep from deep in the planet's mantles requires an initial drilling period to break through the crust and prepare the mining shaft. Oh. Oh, so maybe resources are not finite. I mean, that's like way out of our way out of our. Uh, that's that's way beyond our scope of what we can do right now. But still, um, a depository, nickel, steel, rubber, gunmetal, computer screen. Okay, so what do we have in here? Cast iron. Oh, there's the die molly right there. Silver and copper. So. Is that what we needed for our chisel? 
die molly is silver and copper hold on i think didn't we have some silver alphabetical let's see here i thought we picked up some silver along the way yeah we got silver right here in our debris chest okay so let's grab oh what does this take for fuel oh does it not take anything for fuel oh no way that'd be amazing okay so let's get one of these in here and then we need a pipe so we need brass and copper wait do we have the stuff for brass um oh brass isn't available in here so we actually need both of these little guys okay we're gonna get a better chisel uh that's gonna give us a pipe hardness oh and then damage so like the pipe has a damage by itself Okay, so let's take all of those and use this and then let's make our chisel. And then if we find a diamond, we can get a diamond chisel. Oh, this is gonna be nice. Okay, so what does it say? Uh, hardness is seven. Diamond chisel is hardness of 10. Oh, that is phenomenal. Okay, so now we can get many more resources, which is good. Um, so that, what is the, what is the Zam, Zamalic, Zamic, Zanic or whatever? What is that? Zamac. Zinc, magnesium, aluminum, oh. Zinc, magnesium, Z-M-A, aluminum, A, copper. Okay, what? <laughs> that's weird. Um, okay, so that's what we need. Wow, that's like combine, combining a whole bunch of resources into one thing. Jeez. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so I guess our next order of business... I still don't have a food supply. And honestly, I think what's going to end up happening is we're probably going to just end up dying. And then respawning. Uh, probably. I don't know. We'll see. Because the berries, like I said, they hurt you. But, they, I mean, they give you stuff. So, I don't know. We'll see. Uh, but structures... We need 12 Zamic, 4 wire, 10 rubber, 5 aluminum, derillium, oh my gosh, and steel. But now we can get iron, which is super useful. Um, can we make any, can we make rounds for our pistolio? Because we got this. Small lightweight fires a charge blast, requires ammo, requires ammo maintenance. So like if I use this, so we have no ammo. We make ammo in any of these. High precision upgrades. There's upgrades here. Assault rifle magazine. Fires and blast charge requires ammo. High precision, high precision, high precision. There's a small solar panel kit. Tactical knife. That's probably going to be super huge for us. Uh, uh, a machete. Oh, that's probably going to be super huge for us as well. So, can we build a upgraded, like, workbench yet? Printer? Chem station. I want to get the pew pews. Fences. Oh, we have all kinds of barriers now. So, lead and bronze. Oh, and then here's our custom stuff. Industrial wall, durable bare metal wall, an industrial wall with a door. So like this stuff is super cool. Now I don't think this gives us quite the same bonuses as like building structures. So I think you have to kind of like mix and match the two. Ooh, we got all kinds of stuff to do. Oh my gosh, we have so much to do. <laughs> I mean, we have a pistol, but we don't have any ammo for it, which is unfortunate because I don't even know how to make ammo. I don't think we can yet. That's all right. Um. Yeah, that's going to end this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, this is, I'm going to tell you right now, uh, beginning, starting this game is a little bit more slow going. It feels better when we actually unlock something and build something because it takes like a little bit more effort and work. So uh, yeah, that's super exciting. But I would say this vehicle, super hugely important. And yeah, we're going to start working, I guess, on a habitat in the next episode because i mean we need rubber we need zamic we need wire everything here seems obtainable the wire might be an issue because i don't know how we're going to get plastic without having i mean broken wires i guess we have a bunch of broken wires so i don't know we'll see we'll see how it goes but yes thank you again for coming out hopefully you guys enjoyed if you did like subscribe all the fun things 
and uh see you in the next one